10 Best Picks Presents the Top 10 Best Wide Angle Lens for Canon. Starting at number 10. Panasonic Lumix Professional 8-18mm. The Panasonic Leica DG Vario Elmrid 8-18mm f2.8-4 ASF is a pleasure to use, but the greatest pleasure is arguably in the outstanding sharpness, giving a real punch to images. The pleasure extends to enjoying fine engineering as well, because there is the high quality of the construction and finish to enjoy for its own sake. In summary, a lens that lives up to its Leica tag and should serve very well for many years of use. For more information and price, check out the product links in description, underneath the video. At number 9. Canon F16 to 35mm f4 liters. The Canon F16 to 35mm f4 liters is USM, is a wide angle lens for full frame cameras that sports a zoom range of just over 2x and a constant maximum aperture of f4. Sharpness is excellent, autofocus speeds are very fast, and even with its excellent build quality, thanks in part to the constant f4 maximum aperture, this lens only weighs 615 grams. The 16 to 35 mm f4 liters is USM lens, has a four-stop image stabilizer, and sharp images can be produced around half the time, with shutter speeds as low as 1 to 2 sec at 35 mm, which is roughly four stops slower than the usual rule of thumb would allow for handheld shooting. Number 8 of my list. Canon F16 35mm f2.8 L3. The Canon F16 35mm f2.8 L3 USM is a wide angle lens that offers superb and consistent performance. Sharpness is excellent throughout, as too is California correction, and no flare was present in any of the shots we captured with the lens when we put it to the test. Manufacturing cannot be faulted, and the weather sealing also ticks another plus box. There's no is, but that may be more acceptable in wide-angle lenses, and another negative is the price as it's not something everyone will be able to stretch to. Having said that, if your budget can justify the large margin between it and the alternatives, it's well worth considering. Coming at number 7. Samyang SYIO 35 AFE, 35mm f2.8. Some lenses are a real pleasure to use, and the Samyang AF 35mm f2.8 FE falls into this category. The technical quality is excellent, the AF is fast and accurate, and the results look punchy with superb color rendition. In terms of value, it's hard to argue with such a modestly priced lens when it performs so well. Weather resistance would be nice, as would full-time manual focus in AF mode, but apart from that the lens pretty much hits the spot. It is certainly an excellent match for the Sony mirrorless range for which it has been designed. At Number 6. Zeiss Milvis 25mm f1.4 Z. As always, there will be a price to pay for excellence. None of the 24 to 25 mm f1.4 bright lenses are cheap, but they do represent the cost of high quality optics. The Milvis 25 mm f1.4 represents a variation, sacrificing the AF and pulling no punches in weight or bulk, just delivering solid engineering and optical quality. Manual focus does become more difficult the wider we go, and this may well not be for everybody, but there are others who will revel in the sheer tactile joy of handling a precision, traditional style lens. For more information and price, check out the product links in description, underneath the video. Halfway of my listed number 5. Sony Face 16 to 35mm f2.8 GM. Expensive, but outstanding, the Sony Face 16-35mm f2.8 G Master lens is one to aspire to, and one that upholds the fine performance levels of the G Master range. The focal length range is versatile, the aperture of fast and constant f2.8, and the construction quality of a very high order. In conclusion, a very desirable lens. Coming in at number 4 of my list. Sony Fe 12 to 24 mm f4. The Sony Fe 12 to 24 mm f4 G is expensive, but also excellent, which is always a dilemma. Easy to handle, superb central performance, huge potential creatively. There is so much to like about the lens. There is no doubt this is a very worthy choice for, especially full-frame Sony users. Overall, the Sony Fe 12 to 24 mm f4 G is an excellent ultra-wide lens with huge creative potential. At number 3. Samyang SYIO 14 AFE 14mm f2.8. Samyang has consistently produced some excellent lenses for many years, and now joined the mainstream of AF lenses with equally powerful offerings. The AF 14mm f2.8 f takes us a step further. 
Hitherto, all the AF lenses have concentrated on the Sony A series, but now we see the first autofocus DSLR lens for Canon. It performs well, produced superb images, and is a real alternative at a very attractive price. Nearing the top of my list. At number 2. Carl Zeiss 2111 637mm 35mm. The Zeiss Melvis 35mm f1.4 lens is a bright, high-quality optic with smooth bokeh and a very well-balanced set of properties. It handles beautifully and is a pleasure to use. It exudes a feeling of quality. It is very likely that it will last for many years before needing any attention. The manual focus is utterly smooth, and the point of focus is very easy to achieve. And number 1. Sony E-Mount Fe 24mm f1.4. There are some really excellent lenses available, and the Sony G Master range includes some of the very best. This continues with the new Sony Fe 24mm f1.4 GM lens, which performs impeccably and at a price level that is competitive with Canon, and very much less than Nikon. There are third-party alternatives that are also very good indeed, but for those seeking the manufacturer's own lenses, then this offering is very, very attractive, and an obvious editor's choice, the high expectations that we started out with having been totally met. For more information and price, check out the product links in description, underneath the video. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe my channel, share this video and hit the like button.